difference. I am Prema Petal, and why is this darkie here? She's the only one who turned up. Just me. Well, I am the minister of keeping them out. There's no such minister. <laughs> Don't believe everything you read in the papers, babes. <laughs> is it true that you passed a new bill and in order to prove that it works, you deported your own mother? What? Interesting point. Um, I would like to clear this up for people. So I want the British people to know and understand that there is a war going on right now. There are immigrants, okay? Immigrants are just doggy paddling their way right across the channel and they're trying to take our jobs. You haven't answered my question. What? There is a war going on right now. I don't want to panic anyone, but just run, save yourselves. So what was the question? Have you deported your mother? What? No. No. Oh, hold on. That, that knackered old biddy that was upstairs in my house. Yes, I got rid of her. She was a right mouthy cow. She was making curry all the time. My ass stunk. Immigration. Taxis. Close the borders. And what about the parties? Oh, what? We can't have parties now. Oh, God. It's the only reason I went for this job. So I can have a couple of dirty martinis, you know what I mean? Never do shots, though. It makes me bomb. So you admit to having parties while the rest of us could not? What? No. You, did you say parties? No, I, I said it. I meant business office meetings. <laughs> you, you must have got confused. You've got a very small brain. No one believes you. And listen, listen, just stop picking on me, all right? Listen, just because I've done well and I've moved out of Watford, you're just proper jelly, right? Listen, Gemma Miller as well, if you're watching, I only get black cabs now. I don't even bother getting Ubers or Tramp. <laughs> Did Gemma Miller go to your school? As if, no. She was just always puking outside Pyramid Nightclub. Disgusting she was. But you know what, everyone, we need to make sure we remember there's a war, OK? Because the war is making us not be able to pay for our heating in our second mansion. Say goodbye to your second Mercedes. That's not going to happen. We're all going to have to start going to those dirty, dirty little Indian shops where they triple the price for everything and there's just coriander basically growing out the walls. Get a terrorism. Shut the borders. Taxes and there's a wall, don't forget. Right, I've got to go. Where are you going with the suitcase? I'm just going to nip down to the local co-op, get a couple of bits and bobs, none of your business. By the way, security check her and can make sure she can be here. If not, just deport the bitch. Bye!